fighting Gamecock of South Carolina, 5-0. Notre Dame has not lost to South Carolina, 3-0, 13-6 in Columbia in 76. And last year, Notre Dame had their best game scoring the first five times they had the ball. Notre Dame winning that one by a score of 30-6. Fighting Irish are 13th in the nation in kickoff returns. Averaging 23 and one tenth yard per return. Hiawatha Francisco averaging 37.5. South Carolina. Kicking off. Center twist a short kickoff. Francisco at the 10. Francisco slips and gets to the 24. And he's swarmed upon the 24 yard line where Notre Dame will have it first and 10 at their own 24. Missing efficiency in the nation. There you see his statistics passing thus far this season. Five touchdowns, eight interceptions, 894 yards through the air. From the I formation, Burline calling signals. This is Alan Pinkett tripped up behind the line of scrimmage on a fine defensive play. Coming out of second down and 13. You see the Notre Dame offensive backfield. Alan Pinkett, Mark Brooks, the fullback. Steve Burline back at quarterback. The receivers, Mark Bavaro, the leading receiver with 20 receptions, along with the wideouts, Milt Jackson and Joe Howard. Play action. Burline looking upfield. Gets a pass away to his bound man, Pickett. Pickett to the 29-yard line, and he's brought down there after a pickup of eight. Allen Pickett gaining eight, the offensive line. Mike Kelly, senior. Larry Williams, senior tribe captain. Along with Tim Scannell, Tom Durger, and Mike Perino. It'll be a third down and five call for Notre Dame. They have it at their own 29-yard line. Howard wide to the left, Bill Jackson wide to the right. Two tight ends, the lone running back is Alan Pinkett in a new look for the Notre Dame fighting Irish offensively. Burline, a pitch to Alan Pinkett, gets outside, Pinkett to the 40, knocked out of bounds of the 41-yard line, a great team. Defensively for South Carolina, that's their down line, it's Gerald Davis, four sacks and seven tackles for losses. Their linebackers are active, Paul Vogel is their leading tackler, followed very closely by James Seawright, and the defensive backs led by Bryant Killier. Pinkett up the middle, gets to the 45-yard line, a pickup of three. Notre Dame, they have it at their own 45-yard line. Brooks and Pinkett, the running backs, behind Steve Burline. Inside handoff to Pinkett, tries to squirm free. He gets near offensive line. Penalty marker down on the play, however, in South Carolina. Alan Pinkett comes out of the game. Ricky Gray is in. Notre Dame showing a new look, George, this afternoon with one running back behind Burline, as in this formation, and two tight ends. Well, they're spreading that defense out by using this formation. Mark Brooks gets the call. Barrels his way to the 44-yard line of South Carolina. Great block by Tim Scannell. First down, Notre Dame. Spread a flanker out to each side. This opens up the defense just with one running back. Burline straight back to pass, has great protection, lost one great grab by Milt Jackson, a first down at the 26-yard line. Pass protection, there's Kelly blocking up front, Scannell to the left, and Burline, his shoulder is healed, he threw that one right on the money. First and 10, Notre Dame at the South Carolina 26-yard line. Back is Allen Pinkett for Notre Dame. the 19-yard line on a fine defensive play by Chris Major. A first quarter on a second down and three call. Burline under throwing Joe Howard, so it'll be a third down and three. As we look at Joe Morrison in his second year as head coach of the South Carolina Gamecocks, third and three Notre Dame, lone running back behind Burline is Alan Pinkett. Two tight ends, two wide outs. And off the Pinkett, he stumbles and falls loses a couple of yards on the play. This will be a 40-yard attempt by Carney. Kevin Kelly will snap Mike Viracola to hold. 
John Carney trying a 40-yard field goal here in the first quarter in Notre Dame, Indiana. Good snap. It's spotted Carney's boot certainly long enough, and it is wide to the right. Wide to the right and no good. Carney misses his first field goal try of the year. Over the ball comes center Tom Garner. Chris Wade is wide to the right along with Bill Bradshaw. On the option play, the pitch back, and Robert Banks was pursuing the ball carry. Alan Mitchell, 60% completion rate, 559 yards, five touchdowns, four interceptions. Hey, good, the ball carrier. Hey, good, and Thomas Dempsey are the running backs behind Alan Mitchell. This is Hey, good again, and he goes over the 25 to about the 27 yard line. You call for Alan Mitchell. Mitchell on the option play. He keeps and he's snowed under at the 27-yard line by Ron Weisenhofer, the junior linebacker from Oak Lawn, Illinois. Carolina averaging 41 and one-tenths yards per punt. Troy Wilson and Joe Howard are the deep men. It's a high, long putt. Troy Wilson fumbles the football. South Carolina has it at the Notre Dame 31-yard line. And fumbling the football and South Carolina recovers. It'll be first and ten Gamecocks at the Notre Dame 31. There he tries to get the ball. He took his eye off the ball and it bounced away. Good coverage down there by the South Carolina down lineman. And, and 51 was right in there. Jimmy Gatling. Joel. Inside handoff to Raider Brown, a sophomore running back from Greensboro, North Carolina. He was stopped by Hiawatha Francisco, but Brown picks up a... Brown is in there now instead of Dendy at the running back for the Gamecocks. And Brown can really fly. He's a 9-500. They've got four excellent running backs, and they uh, substitute them freely. Offensive line... Led by Jim Walsh on the option play, keeping as Mitchell gets the first down down to the Notre Dame 17-yard line. Jerry Winley making the tackle. Notre Dame defensively, that down three led by Mike Gann, who has six sacks. Defensive linebackers, Mike Kovaleski, the leading tackler on the Irish, was 74. And the deep backs missing Joe Johnson, the senior try captain. Great effort here by Thomas Dendy down to the Notre Dame six-yard line. Dendy and Haygood, the running backs behind Alan Mitchell. First down and goal to go. This is Dendy running wide, cutting back in. Down to the one-foot line, and he's over, it appears, for a touchdown. He, no, the official calls him stop at about the one-foot line. Alan Mitchell. Mitchell quarterback sneak, touchdown South Carolina. So Alan Mitchell with a quarterback sneak gets his touchdown, and now the conversion attempt by Scott Hagler. Hagler is sophomore from Dublin, Georgia. Ball is spotted, the kick is up, and it is good. We have 7.19 left to play in the first quarter. Take a time out of the action, and we'll be right back after this. For the South Carolina Gamecocks, the deep men are Hiawatha Francisco and Alonzo Jefferson. South Carolina leading 7-0. We have 7-19 to play in the first quarter. Low line drive type kickoff. Fielded and fumbled by Jefferson. Jefferson back up to the 10. Sheds a tackler at the 12. Fumbles the football. A loose ball on the far sideline. Notre Dame recovers. Averting near disaster at the 14-yard line. Notre Dame starting in poor field position, first and ten at their own 13-yard line, trailing seven to nothing. Burline hands off to Pickett. Pickett gets about three, and that's all up the middle to the 16-yard line. It'll Jackson on a second down, seven call for Burline. Pickett gets the call. Pickett up over the 20 to the 22-yard line. He'll be short of the first down by a yard. Good in for Notre Dame from the power eye. Inside handoff, fighting is Brooks, and I don't believe he got it. Mark Brooks did not get the first down. It does not appear. It depends on where the it is per putt. Good snap. Miracola 
Bowler gets a long boot away. This is Dunlap at the 30-yard line. Dunlap up to the 35, up to midfield, slips and falls. And there's a timeout of the action. The score is South Carolina 7 and Notre Dame nothing. And we'll be back right after. 19 left to play in the first quarter. It'll be first and 10 South Carolina. They have the ball at their own 46-yard line. Rolling out on the option is Mitchell, and he's pulled on down by Mike Golick. 84 for Notre Dame. It's a second down and seven call for Alan Mitchell. Mitchell on the option. He's slowed down, and he's nailed at the 49. Banks coming out. Jerry Faust looking out on a third down and seven call for South Carolina. Inside handoff, nothing there for Rainer Brown. He's stopped by Mike Larkin. Nassau Community College in New York. He is a transfer. Troy Wilson and Joe Howard are the deep man. A tremendous putt. They'll let it go, and it goes into the end zone, and Notre Dame will have it first and 10 at their own 20-yard line. Lone running back behind Burline is Chris Smith. Joe Howard wide left. Milt Jackson wide right. Play action right up the middle to Ricky Gray to the 30, the 40, the 45 yard line goes Ricky Gray first down Notre Dame. And pink it back in and running back. He's the lone setback behind Steve Burline. Flags down on the play from the referee. John Scovey illegal. First and 15 for Burline. Smith and Pink at the running backs behind him. In motion goes Milt Jackson. Alan Pinkett, nowhere to go. C. Ray was there first, slowed him down. Backs are split. Pinkett and Chris Smith. Burline looking upfield. Fires down the middle. Got Milt Jackson to the 45-yard line of South Carolina. He'll be close to a first down. Ford again. Ricky Gray coming in as an extra tight end. Two fullbacks, Chris Smith and Mark Brooks. And Alan Pinkett, the tailback. On a third down and about a half a yard to go for a first down. Alan Pinkett over the top, lands on his head, but gets the first down at the 44-yard line. Tight ends in the formation. Lone running back behind Burline is Chris Smith. On a first and ten call, Chris Smith getting a wide pitch, trying to cut it back in. Spins his way down to the 38-yard line. A good effort by Chris Smith. Second down and four call. Hand off to Chris Smith. His way for a first down to the 33-yard line of South Carolina. Goes wide to the right, Joe Howard wide to the left on a first and ten call for Burline. Smith alone running back. Burline back to throw, has good protection. Pump face, has a lot of time, got an open man, Gray. Gray inside the 25 to the 23. He'll be close to a first down in Notre Dame Stadium. South Carolina 7, Notre Dame nothing. We'll be back right after this. Down, but he didn't see him. He had all day to throw. Quarterback sneak Burline. He has the first down of the South Carolina 22-yard line. It'll be formation is working for Notre Dame. First and 10 Notre Dame. They have it at the South Carolina 21-yard line. Play action pass. He's hit. Luckily not intercepted for Notre Dame as he was really racked down hard. Pinkett looks for a block, gets one from Chris Smith, and a fine defensive play by Paul Vogel, who drags Pinkett down at the 19-yard line. Scoring defense, 15th in rushing defense. It's a third down, seven call for Burline. Milt Jackson in motion. Tim Brown's the other wide out. Burline. Watch Brown. Got him. First down, Notre Dame. Inside the five-yard line at the three. Timmy Brown with burning speed. They sent Jazz. They sent the man in motion, and then Brown right across, very shallow. Look at the speed he's got. He runs away from Earl Johnson, the defender. And Timmy Brown, a good catch and run for a first down. Finally steps up. Go. Pitch back to Pinkett. Pinkett. Pulling his way into the end zone. Touchdown, and it's 7-6. South Carolina leading by one. Alan 
Pickett really wanting to get into that end zone. Watch Brooks, 30, 35. He cleans up on Chris Major, but Pickett with his driving legs and great desire into the end zone. Kevin Kelly to snap. It's spotted. The kick is in the air, and it is good. We have 13.37 to play in the first. Carney, the sophomore walk-on. Hancock's 25th in the nation in kickoff returns, averaging 21 and 5 tenths yards per return. Their leading returner is Rainer Brown, number 30. Brown averaging 31.7 per kickoff return. Carney puts his foot into it, a deep kickoff. This is Kevin White is going to run it out of the end zone. Kevin White. To the 20, Kevin White stopped by Pat Ballage at the 23-yard line. It'll be first and 10, South Carolina. Wade, they're wide to the same side. Inside handoff, not much there, South Carolina. South Carolina has yet to put the ball in the air. Now they will. Mitchell going to the sideline, wide open, in and out of the grasp of Ira Hillary. They do throw. They get substantial yardage. Third down and seven. Mitchell back to pass. Gets one over the middle. To the 30-yard line. Up to the 35 and to the 40. A first down, South Carolina. Thrown 40-yard line. On the option play. Mitchell scrambles his way past midfield. A fine effort by Allen Mitchell to the Notre Dame 48-yard line. Mitchell. First and 10, South Carolina. The Notre Dame 48-yard line. Mitchell picks it up, rolls out, looks up field, lost a pass over the head of his intended receiver. Fuller wide to the right on a second down and 10 call. On the option play, Mitchell keeps and he gets to the Notre Dame 45 and that's about it. A pick. Mitchell back to pass, there was motion and he's going to be sacked by Jerry Winley, the nose guard. Jerry Winley coming in. Back by Jerry Winley, who started this season. His third string nose for is Tracy Evans. Good snap. Boot is in the air. Joe Howard at the 18-yard line. Joe Howard to the 20. Small wonder to the 30. Howard to the 40. And a great run back by Howard to the 42-yard line. Got 11.07 left to play here in the first half. South Carolina 7 left to play in the first half. South Carolina 7 and Notre Dame 7. Notre Dame has it first and 10 at their own 42-yard line. Berline brings them out of the huddle. Lone running back is Chris Smith. The wide outs are Reggie Ward to the far side. Tim Brown to the near side. On a first and 10 call. Burline play action, looking upfield, short pass to Ricky Gray, first down inside South Carolina territory to the 43-yard line. Sending Chris Smith, the running backs behind Burline. Burline, little valve pass to Alonzo Jefferson, gets away from one man, gets back to about the line of scrimmage, penalty markers are down on the play. He they have almost 30 yards to go for a first... About 27 to go. Alonzo Jefferson play. South Carolina hawks up. Reggie Ward to the right. Jefferson and Chris Smith are the running backs. Inside handoff, Alonzo Jefferson. He squirms his way to the 49-yard line, and there is another flag down in the play. Can you... Occasionally, if uh, the official wasn't looking. <laughs> Play in the first half. Play action pass. Burline slips but didn't go to his knees. Has a lot of time. Wide open is Ward. Ward inside the 15 to the 11-yard line. This is footing. As you see him go back, the play took so long to unfold that Chris Major, there you see Burline falling. He rolls out to the left. Chris Major fell asleep back there. There he is, 13. He forgot about Reggie Ward. Burline did a nice job getting the ball to him. He made sure 
that he threw the 11 yard line. Alonzo Jefferson, the lone running back behind Burline, and he gets the call and he gets two, and on a second down, a nine call for Burline. Burline rolling out, gets his pass away, great catch, Bavaro inside the five to the four. He's got a third down and three at the four yard line of South Carolina. On a reverse play to Chris Smith, and he fights down to the one yard line. He'll be very close to a first down. Let that much shy. Notre Dame will go for it. 7-7 seven, seven ties, 7-20 left to play in the first half. The yard line. They need that much, the official showing for a first down and a yard and a half for a touchdown. And inches. Fumble. Notre Dame recovers, but it doesn't matter. South Carolina will take over on downs at the three-yard line. And they have a new quarterback, Mike Hold, a 5'11", 195-pound junior. He's a transfer from Mesa Community College. And then Mitchell, he's 10 for 14 for 20. On the option play, penalty marker down, the penalty. Illegal procedure will move the ball back line. Hold brings him out. Inside handoff, nothing there. Stopped at the one unless they call it a safety. No, stopped at the one by Mike Griffin. And the running backs behind Mike Hold, the quarterback. Back to throw is Hold, going for the bundle. Picked off by Troy Wilson. Troy Wilson, the intercept for Notre Dame. He was tacked. backed up. He played it. Look at that great catch. You think he was the offensive receiver. He's the defender. Makes a good catch. And a fine interception. Ball at the fourth picket behind Steve Burleigh. Burleigh's going to put it up on first down. Right over the middle in and out of the grasp of Mark Brooks. Burleigh calling the signal. 6-18 left to play first half. Burleigh. Line defensive play by Joe Brooks on Mark's line. Picked him up pretty well. Third and ten, Burline back to pass, has time, looks upfield, got Milt Jackson inside the 30 to the 20-yard line. Running back is Alan Pickett. Wide outs are Allen to the left, Milt Jackson to the right. Alan Pickett. Alan Pickett. Inside the 20 to about the 17-yard line goes Pickett. Running back now as Pickett goes out on a second down, six ball for Burline. Side handoff, Chris Smith fights his way to the five-yard line of first down. Notre Dame, excellent Notre Dame. They have it at the five-yard line of South Carolina. Play action pass. Touchdown, Notre Dame to Mark Favaro. From Steve Burline to Mark Favaro, and Notre Dame takes a 13-7 lead here in the second quarter. To roll out, the Notre Dame likes to roll out down there, and Favaro into the end zone. He sneaked into the corner. He makes a good catch. Bavaro now 11 of 15 for 181 yards and one touchdown. The conversion attempt by John Carney. Mike Duracola to hold. Kevin Kelly to snap. It's in the air and it is good. We have five minutes left to play in the first half. And there's a timeout of the action with the score. Notre Dame 14, South Carolina 7. Now reception of the year. He's kicked going to White at the two-yard line. Kevin White looking for the wedge, running laterally and wide, and he is chased out of bounds on the far side and in a quarterback. Hold keeps the ball, and he's corralled after a pickup of about two yards. But Carolina's 66 here in the first half. Second down and eight call. Old play action. Looking upfield. Being pursued by Figaro. Wide open is his receiver at midfield and out of bounds at the 41-yard line. The offensive uh, left end. And hold uh, fires the ball. 35-yard pass. Birmingham. First and 10 South Carolina at the Irish 41-yard line. Running wide is Haygood. Inside the 35 to the 30. And finally driven out of bounds at the 20-yard line goes Ken Haygood. It's per carry. There's a flag down on the play. Two-tenths yards per carry. Brings up a first and 15. Wade wide to the left. Hillary wide to the right. Hold back the pass. 
gets out of the pocket, has some running room. Now he reverses his field and is finally dragged down by Robert Banks. The line of Notre Dame. Wide pitch. This is Haygood trying to get outside. He does get outside. Inside the 15 to the 11-yard line. It'll be first down South Carolina. Gamecocks, they have the ball at the Notre Dame 11-yard line. Haygood on the option. Not much there. Dragged down by Mike Gann at the 10-yard line. Inside the 10-yard line. 14-7 Notre Dame, 2.48 to play in the first half. Running wide is Dendy. Dendy cuts it back inside to the five, where he stopped at the five. Dendy and Haygood are the running backs. Wide pitch to Hay to Dendy. Dendy running wide. Larkin missed him, but he holded him long enough for Francisco to get him. Fourth down and a yard and a half to go for a first down, and Joe Morrison will go for it. He will eschew the field goal. Ira Hillary goes wide to the right. Mike Hole, the quarterback. On the option play, a touchdown, Ken Haygood. Haygood got the handoff on a quick opener off right tackle, and he scores a game cock touchdown. First attempt by Scott Hagler to tie the game. Hagler's boot is up, and it is good. We have three-point favorite. 5-0 in the same season. Center Quist kicking it toward the near sideline. Jefferson at the 10-yard line. Jefferson gets a great block up to the 30 and skids down at the 33. High to the left. Allen Pinkett and Chris Smith are the running backs. Inside handoff, Allen Pinkett got some running room up to the 45-yard line, a pickup of a dozen by Pinkett. Uh, looking for pass, and Notre Dame ran. Now Burline looking to throw to the sideline. Incomplete and 10. Second down, 10 Notre Dame. They have it at their own 45-yard line. Burline back to pass. A little flat pass to Allen Pinkett. Pinkett over midfield. Pinkett to the 37-yard line of South Carolina. Burline back to pass. Fires one. Great catch by Joe Howard at the 29-yard line. Seawright hit him after he was down. Notre Dame wants a personal foul. But now an official is ruling that Howard did not catch the ball. That it hit the ground first. Give John Carney for a field goal try. 42 seconds left to play in the first half. Burline. Going deep. Overthrows Milt Jackson, who had a step on defender Chris Major. Up Carolina, 37-yard line. Milt Jackson in motion. Inside handoff to Allen Pinkett, and Pinkett to the 30-yard line. Short of a first down, and Notre Dame will attempt a long field goal, apparently. Notre Dame letting the clock wind down. They'll wait and call timeout, and then attempt a long field goal. Just earlier on a 40-yard try, and that was his first miss of the year. He is six for seven in field goal attempts. Ball is spotted. The kick is in the air. It is long enough. It is good. 48-yard field goal by John Carty. Indiana. With the score, Notre Dame 17 south of those first half statistics, George. Yeah, Notre Dame uh, really grinding out the yardage, 293 to 144. They've got 200 yards passing. Burline 12 for 19, no interception on the ground, 93 yards. Good off to start the second half. Tremendous kickoff. Taken by Brown, one yard deep in the end zone. Brown right up the middle, has some running room. Pat Ballage finally grabs him. Face mask on the kickers. First down. First and 10, South Carolina. They have it at their 39-yard line. Mitchell back to throw, being pursued. Now has some running room. Up over the 40 to the 40. Subway goes wide to the right. Ira Hillary wide to the left. Running backs are Dendy and Haygood. Pounces on the football at the South Carolina 48-yard line. And they went to an even defense. They had uh, a four-man line there. And watch this hit as Dendy goes in there. And he's hit hard in there and fumbles the ball and Golik right on it. Yard line. Steve Berline, who had an excellent first half, brings out the Irish. Allen Pinkett. Pinkett trying to get away from Maloney. 
Bone to up. Milt Jackson on the same side. Jackson in motion. Inside handoff. Chris Smith inside the 40 to the 30. One yard line goes Chris Smith. Cincinnati LaSalle. Burline's going to put it up. A lot of time. Little bow pass to Smith, and Smith gets to about the 25 yard line. A pickup pass is open. Smith gets the handoff. Nothing there. Right at the. Chris Smith, the lone setback behind Steve Berline on a third and four call. Berline rolling out. He's in trouble. Berline still running for his life and fumbles the ball out of bounds at the 30 yard line. Kick is in the air. It is long enough. It is good. A 47 yard field goal by John Carney. 20, South Carolina 14, and we'll be back right after. Dangerous kickoff return. A little short kickoff this time. Free ball, but it goes out of bounds. Right there to try to recover for Notre Dame was Myers. It is going to be declined by South Carolina. They'll take that. He has his wide house to the same side, the left side. Ira Hillary and Eric Poole. On the action play, pitch back goes to Dendy. Dendy driven out of bounds. Down and eight, South Carolina. They have it at their own 36-yard line. Mitchell inside dive play and a gaping hole for Haygood who pulls his way to the Notre Dame 45-yard line. Cox, they have it at the Notre Dame 45-yard line. Back to pass Mitchell going for the bundle. It's picked, knocked down. Almost intercepted by Hiawatha Francisco. Francisco in there at the strong safety. There you see Hiawatha almost... Haygood and Dendy are the running backs. Mitchell back to throw. Looks upfield. Going to the far sideline. It is caught out of bounds by Hillary. Pat Bass completed two and had one intercepted. Hillary wide to the left, wide to the right is Eric Poole on a third down and ten call. And Mitchell's going to put it up again. Gets one over the middle. It's picked off. Intercepted at the 33-yard line. Alan Mitchell looks left, throws right. There the receiver. The second interception of the game. Burline on a first and ten call. Chris Smith, a big hole up the middle. Barrels to the 47-yard line. First and ten Notre Dame with their own 47. Here's Smith again. Not much there. He was tripped up on the line of scrimmage by Carl Hill who's at a fine wide to the right Joe Howard wide to the left lone running back is Chris Smith two tight ends Bavaro and Ricky Gray play action pass up the middle Milt Jackson in and out of his hands in and out of the grass they're coming in trouble and Gilliard the sack of Burline back at the 40 yard line Mike Viracola will punt for Notre Dame. Big rush, Viracola, good, high punt. Fair catch called and made at the 14-yard line. South Carolina back. It uh, rains, and the rain starting to fall here for the third successive week. A lot of rain in the Air Force game, a lot of rain the week before in the Miami game. The field is still fairly dry as South Carolina comes out first and 10 from their own 14. Inside handoff, Lewis, a fumble, Notre Dame recovers. Side handoff there to Quentin Lewis. There he's hit by Golick. The ball pops right out. Alan Pinkett, the running backs behind him. Milt Jackson goes in motion. Alan Pinkett gets the call. Pinkett fights his way to the three-yard line of first down. Along with two tight ends. Here's Alan Pinkett over the top. Didn't get there. Got to about the one-foot line. Second down and goal to go. Notre Dame from the power eye formation. Alan Pinkett up over the top he stopped at the goal line motion. it is a motion penalty 
It's going to... Two fullbacks are Smith and Monahan. Alan Pinkett is the tailback and two tight ends in the power eye formation. Here's Pinkett. He's going to throw back to Burline. Touchdown! Pinkett had the entire South Carolina fire ant defense going with him, and Burline was wide open. Well, we'll watch... Uh could go out there. It's not much of a pass, but he gets it off. All he had to do was throw it up in the air, and Burline got it. Now, this is legal. Notre Dame now is going to attempt a two-point conversion. Alan Pinkett running from the slot back spot. Chris Smith, the running back behind Burline, a two-point conversion attempt. In motion goes Milt Jackson. Burline rolling out. 8.05 remaining to be played in the third quarter. Notre Dame has taken a 26-14 lead. Carney comes down to the ball. This time drives it toward the end zone. Fielded on the one-yard line by Dunlap. Dunlap tripped up at the 17-yard line. Hold is the new quarterback. Throwing up the middle. Here off. Looked like a mix-up in signals for Arizona. Transfer from Mesa Community Place him. Hold an inside handoff. Not a whole lot of running room for Carolina. Bradshaw and Hillary are wide to the right. Running backs are Quentin Lewis and Rainer Brown. Hold back to pass. Has a lot of time. Now firing deep down field and it is knocked down great coverage by Hiawatha O'Connor a low punt hits at midfield and takes a lateral bounce and is down by South Carolina on the line on a first and ten call Chris Smith gets the handoff and Chris Smith is tripping is on, Burline looking up the middle, Holder shoots his intended down, an eight call for Burline. Ball at the Notre Dame 49, Burline straight back to pass. Gets one over the middle, it is in and out of the grasp of his very Dunlap for South Carolina. Ericola gets the boot away, Dunlap will take it at the 13-yard line, back over the 20 and up to the 27-yard line before he's brought down by Brian Beamer. Down. Mike Hold is the quarterback. Here's a wide pitch to Dendy. Dendy has the first down to the 40-yard line before he's stopped by Troy Wilson. First and 10, South Carolina. They have it at their own 40-yard line. Hold back to pass. Slips down, and he is sacked. Now he laterals it off. I guess the play is still in <laughs> number 50. George Connor. Yeah, it, it, Carl, Carl Womble there, he, the play should have been blown dead right there. But Womble, he said, what am I doing with the football? He knows how. Second down and three. And Haygood is hit right at the left by John Carney. Inches short of a first down. It'll be his 22nd birthday today. The offense is center for South Carolina. He's out of Roswell, Georgia. Quarterback sneak, first down, holds. And 10, South Carolina at the 49-yard line. Hold on the option play. Look out. He's racked down for a loss of two on the play. But He's got to come off under his own power. Hold back to pass. Up the middle, got his man to the 41-yard line. Shy Bendy and Haygood, the running backs behind it. Mike Hole. Haygood gets the call. He might. Wide to the left is Chris Wade on a first and ten call, and there is a penalty down on the play. Moved on the line of scrimmage. He was the most. Bendy and Haygood. First and 15, and Mike Hand jumps up. Encroachment on tight end is Danny Smith. Hold back to pass. Being chased by Gann. Gets away from Gann. Gets away from another defender. Inside. 
inside the 30 to the 28 yard line. Here comes Chris Wade. Second down and a yard to go for the first down. This is Haygood racing wide. Haygood gets outside, cuts back in. Finally stopped by Ballage at the 17-yard line, but a first down, South Carolina. And Gamecocks, they have it at the Notre Dame 17-yard line. This is Haygood again. Barrels for about four. I haven't seen him in there. Of course, he's had that uh, bad finger, which was severely infected last week, and he played. But uh, maybe they decided to hold him out this week to get him healthy. Second down and about seven. Hold back to pass. Looking upfield. Being pursued by Golick. Gets one. Oh, he throws it into the seats. Threw that to him. Hillary wide to the right. Fool wide to the left. Hold. Gets away from Gann. Now he's going to scramble. And he's brought down from behind. Notre Dame leading 26 to 14. Calling the signals is Mike Holt. Pitch back to Lewis. Racing wide. Gets a pass away. And it is picked off. There's a penalty down. There's an official down. And a penalty marker thrown in the end zone. It was picked off by Hiawatha Francisco. But we're going to get an interference call in the end zone. That is Lewis. Lewis pass. ran so far to set it up. He runs way out there. He's He's looking for uh, Bill Bradshaw. Excuse me, Hiawatha made the uh, call. Two and a half yard line. First and goal to go for South Carolina. This is Haygood. Haygood did not get there. Met head on at the goal. Old calling the signals, quarterback sneak, and he is close. He's in the end zone for a touchdown, South Carolina. So South Carolina will attempt the two-point conversion. Holds running backs are Thomas Dendy and Ken Haygood. Haygood gets into the end zone for a two-point conversion, and it's two points. The blocking by Bill Barnhill, the offensive tackle, along with Dell Will. To do the kicking. That's a driving kickoff taken by Jefferson at the two. Alonzo Jefferson back up, and he is rocked down hard. It's Milt Jackson. Chris Smith and Alan Pinkett are the running backs behind Burleigh. Play action. Fires one. That's picked off by South Carolina at the 30-yard line. An interception, and the Gamecocks have it first and 10. Paul Vogel. Line throws the ball quite on the line. He doesn't get an arch to it, and Vogel there jumps high. There was a tenant for small wonder. This is the quarterback. This is Haygood. Gets away from one man, fights his way down to the 22-yard line. Behind hold on a second down and three call. Here's Haygood again. At this time, he fumbles. Notre Dame has recovered. Haygood fumbles. Notre Dame. Winley comes out. He doesn't give up. He's hit there by Wally Klein. And Winley covered the bar line. Alan Pinkett. Pinkett cuts it up to about the 35-yard line. A pick, but he's six against Air Force. Here's Alan Pinkett. Nailed behind the line of scrimmage on a big defensive play by Glenn Wood. the draw play to Pinkett. Pinkett nowhere to go. Is corralled at the 31 turn. Ten men on the line of scrimmage for South Carolina. Good snap. They're coming after it. Viracola gets it off though nicely. And it takes a Notre Dame roll. Inside the 30 to the 25 where it's down. Carrying the Freedom and Aloha Bowls exclusively on TCS Metro Sports. A reverse to Hillary. Hillary gets a block. Hillary Tightrope walking line. Mike Hold has come on for Alan Mitchell to guide the game. Cox, and he's done an excellent job. On the option, Hold keeps, and he slips down. Face mask against Notre Dame. At the uh, left linebacker. First down and five. Hold keeps. Hold gets the first down, and then some to midfield before he's finally dragged down by Zyra Hillary on a first and ten from midfield. away from one man. He scrambles for five to about the... Old fading back. 
looks up field. Got his man. Great catch by Haygood, and Haygood to the 36, and he's hit head on by Robert Banks. Slide. Hold calls the signal. Hold on the option play. Cuts it back up. Hold gets about three, and there he's 622 Notre Dame. 913 left to play. Second down and eight call for Mike Hold. It'll be a third down and eight call. Hold back to pass. Being rush. Gets away from the rush. He's going to run for a first down and maybe more. Hold inside the five. Touchdown, South Carolina. A great scrambling effort by Mike Hold, the junior quarter. Let's look at it from behind the offense here. You can see what the quarterback sees ahead of him. Watch him look around there to see where the openings are. Here's a cut on Steve Lawrence and a good block there by Eric Poole. And he powers in. Hold, the backup quarterback, has done an excellent job at bringing the Gamecocks back. It is good. So South Carolina now with a three-point lead. After this. as he kicks off and it's taken by Brown. He fumbles, picks up his own fumble. Brown straight up the middle to the 27 where he's dropped. First and 10 Notre Dame. They have it at their own 27 yard line. Burline, quick pass in and out of the grasp of Ricky Gray, the tight end. Second and 10 call for Burline. Hand off to Chris Smith. He fumbles. South Carolina ball loose. South Carolina has recovered at the Notre Dame. at first and 10 inside the Notre Dame 20-yard line as Tempers flare. Well, the handoff to uh, Chris Smith going to the outside. The ball is bounced out. Two or three uh, South Carolina players after it. Well, I believe uh, number 21... Offsetting penalties, personal fouls on both sides. South Carolina will have it first and ten at their own at the Notre Dame 17 yard line. Three, Mike Hold, the quarterback. Wide pitch. This is Brown. Brown inside the ten to about the seven yard line. Six game Cox lead. Wide pitch to Brown again. Brown tries to cut it back and he gets to the five and no more. calling the signal. Racing wide and cutting back in. Lewis dies for a game cock touchdown. Does Quentin Lewis, the senior from Midway, Georgia. Desmond. Ball spotted. His kick is up and it is good. We have 747. 47 left to play. Scott Hagler will kick off for the Gamecocks. It'll be taken by Hiawatha Francisco at the three-yard line. Francisco nailed at the 16-yard line. Ten at their own 16-yard line. Burline hands off to Pinkett. Pinkett gets up to the 21. Burline, another handoff. Pinkett really rocked down hard at the 27 in the fourth quarter. Here at third and four, Burline in some trouble. Gets a wobbly pass. Got Joe Howard. with Alan Pinkett, the lone running back behind him. He gets a pitch, and Pinkett racing inside is corralled down after a pickup of around five. Here it's 36-26 South Carolina. And absolutely nothing there for Chris Smith. Third down. Burline rolling out, looking upfield. He's going deep, and it is caught by Reggie Ward. Ward out of bounds at the 16-yard line. Today. First and ten, Notre Dame. Burline rolling out, looking upfield. He's going to try to run it, and he gets a few inside the 15 to about the 14. Two scores uh, to win or tie. Playing 
a steady rain in Notre Dame Stadium at second down and six for the Fighting Irish. Here's Alan Pinkett. Pinkett inside the 10. Pinkett pulls his way close to the end zone. He is shy by about a half a yard. Touch her line to Pinkett. Pinkett over the top. Touchdown Notre Dame. Alan Pinkett with his first one to slot back on the right. Chris Smith, the lone running back behind Steve Berline. In motion comes Milt Jackson. Berline rolling out. Gets his pass away. Batted down nicely by Chris Major. Notre Dame 32. We'll be back right after this. To catch the ball. Clemens is a man to watch. Number 29 on the far side. Along with Brandy Wells. Now he kicks it deep. This is Ira Hillary. Juggles the ball. Can't pick it up. Hillary the eight-yard line with 422 left. Notre Dame using their one with one of their timeouts here. It'll be first and ten Gamecocks. Now you see the comparison of the quarterbacks. Holdo has scrambled for a lot of yardage. This is Haygood. Spencer in there, Raynard Brown, number 30. There's Raynard Brown, and Brown is tripped up behind the line of scrimmage by Jerry Winley. The He's got a man wide open in the near sideline. First down, South Carolina at the 24-yard line. Let's say have it at their own 24-yard line. There's a wide pitch. Slipping is Dendy, and Dendy... 36-30. Here comes Dendy, racing wide. Tries to cut it back widely right there, among others. Old brings him out. reverse. He's in trouble. Banks nails him back at the 14-yard line. Robert Banks. Not fool. Deep men for Notre Dame. Watch Mike Haywood. It's out of the end zone for a safety. A safety on a bad snap. There is a penalty marker down in the play, however. It's against South Carolina. Joe Howard, the deep man. Watch number one, Haywood. He gets blocked out. Great punt by O'Connor. This is Troy Wilson back in midfield. Looking to the sideline. Runs out of bounds at the 47-yard line. On the left. Out of first and 10 call. Burline looking upfield. Fires deep. Oh, in and out of the grasp of Mark Bavaro, who is wide open. At 47-yard line. Back to pass. Firing deep, a wobbly ball, and it is intercepted by South Carolina at the seven-yard line. Number 22, Earl Johnson, the intercept, and that should about ice the game for the Gamecocks. Uh, running down, he just ran a sprint out, an error. Yeah, 22, Earl, Earl Johnson was right with him. Uh, Howard could have been called, I think, for offensive interference there, but Earl Johnson stayed right with it and made the... Mike Hole, the quarterback. He'll just sit on the ball. Hole just sits on the ball. That'll stop the play at the two...